Hello viewers, welcome back to our YouTube channel. We are continuing with our study on Henry Gibson's A Doll's House with specific focus on Act 3, Episode 3, Part 2. In this part, we will consider six issues that Nora raises during her final conversation with Tova, what she calls the settling of accounts. The first issue that she raises, she says that she has been greatly wronged by both Tovald and her papa. And this one is seen in page 110, where she paradoxically states that Nora uh, Torvald has only felt it pleasant to be in love with her, but Torvald has never loved her. The second issue, Nora flashbacks to how her father made her inherit his opinions. Her papa talked about his opinions and she took up those opinions as her own. Then again, if she differed with her papa's opinions, then she pretended not to, because this could have really act her father. The third uh, uh, issue, Nora states that she was then transferred to Toval from her papa's hands and on that transfer Toval arranged everything according to his taste. Nora then adopted Toval's taste. She did not have her own taste. She is left wondering whether she is not sure whether she pretended to love Toval's taste or she did not love Toval's taste. Number four, Nora also paradoxically states that she has not been happy at the Helmer's house. She has only been married. For quite some time I've talked about paradox. Paradox is an aspect of style where a writer brings up two contrasting ideas in the same statement. For, uh, for example, on this issue 4, Nora states that she has not been up, she has only been married. Mary and happiness, for many of us, we consider it as just moral the same thing. Just the same way Nora stated that uh, Torvald did not love her. Torvald only felt it pleasant to be in love with her. So there are contrasting ideas in those statements and that is what qualifies them to pass as paradox. Number five, Nora metaphorically compares her marriage and her home to a playroom. In this playroom, Nora states that she was her papa's doll child. She has been uh, Toval's doll wife and she has felt it amusing when Toval plays with her just the same way the kids feel it amusing when she plays with them. So in page 112 she considers her home and marriage to be a playroom. In uh, issue 6 Nora tells Tobald that he is not the man to, ed to educate her into being a proper wife. That is in page 112 and this one, 
we see when Tobald, as a reasonable man, he reasonably confesses that whatever Nora is saying that the house has been a playroom has some truth. However overstrained the argument may be, he reasonably confesses that there is some uh, truth. So then Tobal says that playtime is now over and they now want to embark on lesson time. That is when uh, Nora strikes the thunderbolt by telling Tobal that he is not the man to educate her into being a proper wife. Thank you viewers. If you've not subscribed to the channel, remember to subscribe, like and share.